Assalamu alaikum everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today is the day of Arafah. Alhamdulillah. Prophet Muhammad wasallam said, Today is the best day in the entire year. The day of Arafah is important because this day is the day Allah forgives millions of Muslim sins. And it is also the day Allah perfected the religion of Islam. Our Prophet Muhammad wasallam said that the best night is one of the last 10 days of Ramadan. It's because that day is the day that Allah sent the Quran to Prophet Muhammad Prophet Muhammad said the 10 days before Eid al-Azha you should do more good deeds like praying more, reciting Quran, Zikr and helping others out. These 10 days are called Dhul Hijjah. Prophet Muhammad wasallam said, you can fast on the last nine days before Eid. The last three days are the most important ones. The Prophet said, today, the day of Arafah, if you fast, you, you, like your sins will be wiped out for this year and the next year. Like if you do a bad thing, a sin, and don't ask forgiveness from Allah, it will still count as a sin. But if you ask forgiveness, Allah will delete that sin and you won't have any sins. So I am fasting these three days, alhamdulillah. These 10 days, people are doing Hajj. And the day of Arafah is the most important time in Hajj. Arafah means knowing. And at Hajj, when you go to Arafah, you know uh, about other things other people. So, Prophet Muhammad wasallam gave a speech on this day. Our Prophet was doing Hajj at that time. That was his only Hajj he ever did. He actually did four Umrahs but only one Hajj in his entire life before he died. And that time he thought that he knew that he would probably never see any others in this world again, so he gave his speech. He said 14 things on his speech. The first one is protect each other because each Muslim's life should be respected and is important. The second one is don't hurt anyone so they don't hurt us. The third one is remember to be good because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will check your deeds. The fourth one is when you give a loan don't take interest back. That means taking extra back than what you actually gave. The fifth one is be careful of shaitan even if it is a small bad thing. The sixth one is men and women have their own jobs and responsibilities. The seventh one is that men and women should respect and help each other. 
the eighth one is that men and women should be pure and modest. The ninth one is to strictly follow the five pillars of Islam. Believe in Allah, pray on time, give zakat, fast in Ramadan, and do hajj. So the tenth one is that all Muslims are brothers and sisters to each other. The eleventh one is that no one is better than the other by money, skin, or race, but can be by piety and good deeds. The twelfth one is that there will be no other prophets. So Prophet Muhammad وسلم, is the last prophet and Islam is the last religion. The thirteenth one is that we would be lost without the Quran and Hadith. The last one, the fourteenth one, is to spread these messages and give dawah. The day of Arafah is a blessed day and we should try to follow Allah's teachings more. We should pray more, recite Quran more, and do zikr. Hope you guys like this video. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.